Banana peanut butter, banana peanut butter. I want it right now. Banana peanut butter, banana peanut butter, banana peanut butter. I want it right now. Banana peanut butter. When I get hungry and I really need a snack, and my tummy starts growling like it's going to attack, I turn to my daddy and I say, Hey, dad, hand me a banana, pretty please, and just a tad of peanut butter on a spoon. Make it quick, make it soon. I'll let you get it ready while I sing this tune. Banana peanut butter, banana peanut butter, I want it right now. Banana peanut butter, banana peanut butter, banana peanut butter, I want it right now. Banana peanut butter. If you've never had this combo, here's what you gotta do. Next stop, Flavor Town, population two. Grab a ripe banana and a jar of peanut butter. Hello, everyone. <laughs> Welcome back to a week review. Here what the hell kind of intro is this? <laughs> Where's the energy? Oh we're here to regretfully inform you. That's why we're wearing black, because we are mourning right now. Um, there's been an accident. Andy, unfortunately, <laughs> was involved. Don't with, laugh. With a Funko-related accident. Um, he got funked up. He got funked up, and now we're mourning. Anyway, you're not here for that. You're here for the prizes. Welcome back to the Week in Review. My name is Jess. This is Bianca. We've got Blake behind the camera and Luke over on the deck mixing it up. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Um, of course, this is the weekly show that we do to show you all the brand new stuff that is coming to the warehouse. Crazy cool things. Oh my God, what are you going to grab? Uh, but of course, we're also going to give away some prizes. And Bianca, what are those prizes? So we have a boomy. Boomy from Avatar. Boomy. Boomy. <laughs> Boomy. And we also have this Garfield all over print uh, comic strip backpack. Yeah, to give away. yeah, yeah. Look, yeah. it's got a little pokey zipper charm as well. Lasagna. <laughs> lasagna. I love me some lasagna on a Monday morning. Uh, guys, if you want to go into the chance to win those awesome prizes, be sure to leave a comment, ask us some questions, tell Luke he looks nice as M and D beanie today, um, and just you know have a little chit chat in the comments, and Luke will put you on the wheel. We'll spin the wheel at the end of the show, and then if the name lands, the the, the, the what? We do the spinny thing and someone's going to win. The it lands spinny on wheel. The spinny wheel. If you, spinny your wheel. name gets picked on the spinny wheel, guess what? You get a prize. Crazy. I but know. only one. If it lands on you twice, you've got to spin again. Sorry. This is yeah, yeah, a completely yeah. unheard of format. Yes. Anyway, uh, Bianca, where do you want to go? Where do you want to start? There's so much to do. Well, look, so much we, to see. We got a lot of Funko. I feel like we've got to start knocking out some Funko. We're funked. <laughs> All right. We are funked up this week. Let me tell you. Like, look at this. We've got... Two sides of the table full Bruh. of Funko, and we've even got some overspilled down here too. There's so much no stuff. No wonder Andy got crushed. <laughs> <laughs> so let's bunk and get into it. Oh, God. Oh, <laughs> so we got some SV pops get to close. start. Uh, we've got British Bulldog, Liv Morgan, King Booker, uh, the best rendition of Booker T for some reason. Uh, we've got Beth Phoenix, and we've got Roman Reigns as a dual champion at the very bottom there too. And from Star Wars, we've got the very frightening looking Purge Trooper. We've got the Grand Inquisitor. We've got Ned B. We've got Obi-Wan Kenobi. And we have young Luke Skywalker as well. Um, next up, we have the Ego Waffle. was part of the Ad Icons line from Funko. Pretty cool. Now we have Eric Draven from one of the best movies Smash. of all time. Smash. 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 Oh my. So we've got two versions of him there. There's one that comes with the guitar and another one where he's just, you know, being amazing and stuff. Uh, we've also got from Killer Clowns from Outer Space, we have Fatso and Baby Clown as well. And next up from Ted Lasso, we've got Roy Kent. Ted Lasso himself. We've got Rebecca Welton, Keely Jones, and Ted Lasso again. I don't know any of these references. I have not watched Ted Lasso Everyone at all. Everyone just laugh at the funny references. What about <laughs> Sam? And we've got Sam, Sam at the bottom. I don't know how to say his surname, so I'm not even going to try. No, no, Next no, no up we have to. Dog. That's what oh, we do on this show. Oh, That's what we try on. Yay, Yay, thank you, Blake. Now I don't have to. <laughs> Uh, we've got Snoop Dogg woof, woof. as well with the chalice for some reason. And give a dog a bone. Uh, we've got 21 Savage as well. We've got Ed Sheeran from the Bad Habits Bad music Habits. video. And we've got Usher. 
as well. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Usher, Usher. Usher. <laughs> oh my God. <laughs> I did it again, so I'ma let the beat rock, rock. <laughs> We also have some Nightmare for Christmas pops, which I'm pretty excited about. We've got The Pumpkin King, and then we've got Jack Skellington in the lab. We have Sally um, by The Gravestone. Uh, we have Jack Skellington by The Halloween Tree and by The Christmas Tree as well, each leading to their respective towns and whatnot. Now we have some Sportsman, Sportsman Slam magazine covers. So we've got Damien Lillard. I don't know who that is. <laughs> Uh, we've got another guy, I don't know how to say his name, Giannis? Giannis Antetokounmpo. Oh Thank you. My. Look at you. Uh, we have Derek Rose down the bottom as well. And then we've got Stephen Curry, Luca D Don. Donkey. Donkey, thank you. Donkey. <laughs> donkey, <laughs> come here, donkey. And we've got donkey. Scotty Barnes at the bottom. And before we move over to the other side, we may as well cover some of the other little bits may and bobs that well. are down here. Oh, <laughs> we've got some well. top. Do we? Do we really? <laughs> uh, we've got some popsies. Well, one popsy. Comes with a little pop up message. Put that thing down. Give, yeah, a beautiful nightmare. Yeah, you give it to your loved that, one. That sounds, like, that, sounds like, that sounds like a MySpace quote. Yeah. Yeah, it does. Anyway, we've also got some pop pins um, from Harry Potter. We've got a whole bunch of Patronuses. So we've got Harry Potters, we've got Hermione oh. Grangers, oh. <laughs> <laughs> we've got Ron Weasley's and Albus Dumbledore's as well. What is this order you went in? <laughs> I don't know, Blake. I'm just looking. Um, we've also got a tiny yeah. little version of SpongeBob and Patrick being best friends in their Aww. best friend shirts, which Bless. I love. Uh, we also have Doug with toys, pop keychain. I yeah. am Doug. Pretty cute. And from Jujutsu Kaisen, we have complicated names. Yes. Uh, Satoru, so Nobara, and... Megumi? Hell yeah. Close enough, I Queen. Close enough. <laughs> <laughs> um, and on the other side, Jess, ah, we have ah, a whole bunch ah, more stuff. We got... No! <laughs> <laughs> what? <laughs> um, first up, we've got Naruto from Baruto. Next generation, this is Naruto ba Baron mode. Byron Bay mode. Byron. <laughs> And then we also have this awesome Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles uh, Mutant Mayhem Leo in the Turtle Van. Yeah, Whoa, yeah, from from from. There's, there's an awesome video of this on our Instagram. Be sure to check that out. And then we also have uh, Bibbo with Shorty in the Pizza Box. Mm. That sounds like a killer clown from our space, ladies and gentlemen. Like Pluto. Damn. Um, I love rock and roll, but I'm sure you're gonna love this Joan Jet uh, Gold Funko figure. Which is really cool in her little pink suit, slaying the absolute boots down house. <laughs> <laughs> then we've got some more uh, Teenage Mutant Ninja, Ninja Turtle ones. We've got Donatello, Michelangelo, and Raphael. Um, and then we can also have uh, Splinter, April, April O'Neil, Superfly, and Leonardo. Going on back to Guardians of the Galaxy, we have Star Lord with his pew pew pews. Uh, we have uh, Darth Vader. In a, what is it? In the TIE Fighter. In the TIE Fighter. Another pew, pew, pew. <laughs> um, we have oh, Giancarlo Stanton. Yeah. With a... No, 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 no. <laughs> we also have what, Ronald... Have you found a Zelda sword? sword? No, that's like the <laughs> thing they do in baseball. <laughs> <laughs> no, no, never mind. It's this, different. No. Ronald... Slay. Uh, and then we got Mitsuki with snake hands from Baruto. We got Shin Shinki and Sumeri with Nu. All right. We also got up here Baruto with Rasini. Oh, what the hell? Rasini. Yeah, Rasen Baruto. Rising again. Rising again. And then another. Is it the same pop? No. Sure. It glows. Oh, Glow in the dark version. Don't mind me. And at the bottom, we also have a uh, Sa Sarada with. <laughs> oh my <God>. Sarada. <laughs> with Shari. Oh my God. Yeah, it's a pop. Um, next up, <laughs> we have um, from Trailer Park Boys. We've got Julian, Bubbles, and Ricky with. Big old Sig. 
Uh, <laughs> <laughs> uh, and one of the prizes today, we have King Boomy. Boomy. Absolutely booming. Boom. Uh, and then we also have from Jujutsu Cards and Panda and uh, Toge Inumaki. Yeah, it's yeah, like. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Anyway, bear with cocaine. Uh, whoa. <laughs> oh, happy Friday. Um, so this is from the film Cocaine Bear, and he's got a big old trunk in there and the duffel bag. Just a ripping into he's, it. God, yeah. God damn. Uh, he's going to have a good old time. Next up we have Spider-Man. Um, Bianca, what's special about the Spider-Man one? So that's a faceted <laughs> Spider-Man, so it's really like angular and shiny. Um, Funko have done a few in this line. The latest is Spider-Man. Spider-Man. Is it supposed to, it's supposed yeah. to look like a cut gem? Is that the whole... Yeah, yeah they're meant to look mm. all like... And this one's going to look special. like a gem in your collection. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. So Every time I think of Spider-Man, true. there was this like YouTube series like, I'm Batman, I'm Padman. Oh, was that a really weirdly <laughs> yeah. animated one? Yeah. 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 Anyway, uh, Gremlins, we got Gizmo and Stripe, an awesome black light. Yeah. Uh, really cool glows. Awesome under an actual black light. Hey, we got one of those. I've got one of those in my hand. I'm coming. Whoa. Oh, oh that's sick. Black light, everybody. Yeah. So Look at that. Yeah. All right, back to the light. Let there be light. Cool. Uh, so that's it from the normal stand pops. But then we have a few sodas as well. We have Greedo from Star Wars. Uh, we also have, is it just Dr. Ian Malcolm? Never Whoa. seen Jurassic Park. Yeah. And folks, if you haven't seen already, get yourselves onto the Pop Culture Stories on Instagram and Please. have a little look see, a little gander through there. You might see a little pre death Andy. A deceased Andy. friend. Yeah. Um, <laughs> a little <laughs> Ian Malcolm action. And then we also have uh, Bedtime Bear from Care Bears, as well as uh, Groot in pajamas in a little fat lamb, aka a two litre bottle kind of thing. It's, it's little, three litres. It's, it's a little fat lamb. Um, <laughs> really cool, really vibrant, really, really cool. Um, and then down here, we've got a few more kind of two packs, VHS kind of looking ones. We've got Darth Maul and Ahsoka, have a little duel, and we also have Yuji Itadora and Io Tudo from Jujutsu Kaisen. Uh, live long and prosper with this in your collection. This is a Star Trek, what does it say? Universe. <laughs> it's Spock, boys and girls. Mmm, Spock. Lovely. <laughs> and then we also have Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles. Why does that one have glasses? What? You know, I don't yeah. tell him I can't. I think really this enjoy is like from the new, this is from the new Turtles. Yeah, so this is, is from that another band as well. And these glow in the dark. Whoa, well, hold on. Yoinked. Do they? Oh, God. Give, give him a zing with the torch. Where? Where's the torch? Oh. Black light yeah. will get him going. Yeah, yeah. There we go. Yeah. There we go. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's going to really just wow and a wow. That's pretty cool. Okay, mm. okay. That's a slay. Bianca, what have you got there? I've got a pop oh. movie poster. This is Peter Pan. Whoa. Oh, Peter Pan. Well, he's a large Peter Pan because it's a movie Big poster, boy. so they're bigger than the standard size. He's got a little Tinkerbell that's like the size of a pop keychain just flying around there. Mm. It's cute. You can see a little bit better how it's like kind of laid Luke out. Me and Luke both agree that the little like swooshing here. Here, looks like a garnish they would do on a fancy plate at a oh, restaurant of the sauce. Yeah, yeah. and then they get the spoon. That, that's a good nash. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. It does. Or a fruit roll up. Yum. Oh, yes. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Delicious. Yeah. Let me in. I want to eat it. Please don't Let eat me it, in. Let me in. <laughs> <laughs> And we've got some shiny foil going on too because this shiny. is part of Disney 100. 100 years of Disney celebration. God. Pop and moon poster. Jesus. Yes. Happy birthday. Happy yeah. birthday. Uh, what's next? Do you want me to quickly go through the records that are on the ground? Oh, uh, we've sure. got some Funko plushies. Though. Okay. Yeah. This is My Hero Academia. So we've got Deku. We've got All Might here. Um, what is your name, sir? Hello. Uh, back. Back no. ago, I believe. Back ago. Battle gone, battle brawls, um, <laughs> and this chick. She's cute. Look at her little mm. blushing cheeks. No, she's nervous. <laughs> oh, she's shy. She's shy. Is it, her name's probably on the card? May something? I may be wrong. Not on no butt. <laughs> Don't mind me. <laughs> oh. My Hero Academia, everybody. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, you might hear Don't forget to remove the packaging away from kids. Academia. Into a bad record Ladies and gentlemen, you might still be in line to get Taylor Swift tickets, and if you are, 
Good luck. God bless. <laughs> God, God bless. You are fighting a war that I never could. Uh, but you know, God if you're not the toughest battle, st- <laughs> strongest. <laughs> Um, but you know, if you're not swift enough to get some tickets, oh. well, you can be swift enough and get some awesome records. Oh. We just had an awesome restock. This is Taylor Swift's folklore. Explicit. And I, I know. What does she do? Taylor, stop. Did anyway. She the C word. <laughs> <laughs> Mm, it's pressed on beige vinyl. It's a great album. My favorite song on this would definitely have to be the Cardigan, um, not just because it says it on the sticker, uh, but it's a good, it's a good track. I really like it. But yeah, sing it. When you feel like no, 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 I got it. And under someone's bed, you pulled me in and said I was your favorite. Comments. Tell me if that was real. <laughs> Beatles. Beatles. That's very bold. I know it's really cool. So this is the Beatles one album. This is a compilation album of all their best songs. Um, I may have already spoken about this, but we had a restock because these just didn't last that long. These are great. If you are new to record collecting, as I always say, definitely get into the compilation album so you don't have to worry about collecting a whole discography for the time being. Maybe later on in your collecting adventure you can. Or you can just get this. I did. Um, so it has songs like Yesterday, uh, Love Me Do, uh, Hey Jude, The Ballad of John and Yoko, oh. My Best Song. The be- my Best Song? Yes, I wrote it. Oh. <laughs> um, my favourite song, Let It Be, Come Together, Penny Lane. You know, it's the Beatles. What can I say? It's good stuff. And lastly, we have Florence the Machine Dance Fever live at Madison Square Garden. So Dance Fever was the latest release from Florence the Machine earlier this year and just absolutely dominated the charts. So this is the live album they did recorded at at Madison Square Garden. This also features a few other tracks from within her discography, like Dog Days Over, uh, Shake It Out, Never Let Me Go and things like that. How would you describe the sound of Florence? Ethereal, Luke. Ethereal? And she just loves frolicking around in her gorgeous dresses and frocks on stage. But she is just really cool. And I love her. Yeah. She's a slay. Anyway, that's all for the records today. Bianca, take it away. What are we going to look at? Well, let's look at some Loungefly. I have a little bit of Loungefly. A oh, tiny, kitty. tiny, tiny bit of yes. Loungefly. This is one of our prizes um, for Good today. News. So this is an all over print news, of Garfield comic strips, Good which God. is really cool. Garfield, my well, first Zag fandom. Man. Um, yeah, so this is pretty cool. We've got a Pookie um, zipper charm there as well. And I love how we've just got some like bordering with like a pop of Garfield orange. Mm. It is very, very cool. And we also have super sequin, whoops, stay, mm. a super sequiny Hello Kitty here with a little apple zipper charm. Does she like apples? She is five apples tall. That's... And she- such a strange way to Genetically mutated apples or sta- what kind of apples? We're talking US standardized apples or Australian standardized Do Japan- apples? Do Japanese yes, have so big apples or small apples? I don't know. Do they have pesticides? I, I don't no, know. Bananas is a legitimate form of measurement. Next no. question. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> no, I think they did that just to up. make her more like uh, cutesy and be like, so kids can be like, oh, it's like five apples tall, yay! Because a regular cat's that big. She's not a cat; she's a human. That's feral. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I think she's Put meant to be a regular. Cat. <laughs> Anyways, <laughs> super shiny. We've got sequins absolutely everywhere. We've got some embroidery here. We've got mm. a little applique bow as well, which is kind of squishy. Kind of squishy. Mm, and ASMR. <laughs> and we've got a little hit on the back here with a, a little little teddy bear, a little plushy teddy bear. I think. At this point, it might just be another human who's only two apples tall. <laughs> <laughs> could be, could be. Now, we've also got um, some new stuff from Primitive to talk about, which is pretty exciting. Um, so they have partnered up with um, Bob Marley. Um, we've got <laughs> socks. <laughs> with him? <laughs> we've got socks. We've got a T-shirt. Guess what he's doing? Oh, wait, he's not on this one. <laughs> That's fine. It's like four fifty now. Well past 420. Yeah, it's gone. <laughs> We're starting too late. Jeez, jeez. Uh, we got hoodies as well. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Illegal. It's <laughs> the illegals. It's his one love. Okay. The, the weeds. <laughs> and we've got a couple of decks as well. 
So yeah, 420. And then we've got this really cool live deck as well. Nice. Yeah. Nice. Pretty cool. Um, we've also got. Ooh, oh. it's weed green. <laughs> <laughs> it is weed green. <laughs> we got uh, Minop. Oh, yeah, Monopoly. <laughs> Monop the Monop you want to monopolize Jarris Bulge? <laughs> <laughs> Jeez. <laughs> As, Is it one of the tokens? Oh, please. <laughs> what what, what are, are they? they? A hand? So that's him it doing should be the one ball. of the utilities you can buy. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> that's the thing. And then there's a teddy bear with a little baby. And then that's like an apple with a worm came out. Mm. Anyway, he's got a big old bowie on her. That's all you need to know. Look mm. at him. Look at him in his slaying eye makeup. He's like a... Jareth? Jareth the Goblin King. Mm. Yeah. Yes. Smash. Yes. <laughs> Smash. <laughs> <laughs> we've got some money boxes as well. Yeah. These are super mm. cute. Sanrio. So we've got he Hello Kitty as a dinosaur. Hello Kitty as a unicorn. And my melody. My melody. Shiny. Really shiny my melody. Iridescent, almost pearl mm. kind of. Yeah, pearl. Yeah, per yeah, yeah, oh, yeah. oh. I know what I'm talking about. Well, well. So those are pretty cute. We've got a whole bunch more up on the website as well. Like we've got a Gretsuko, we've got Groot and a whole bunch of other characters Need to save well, your coins really during cool. this recession? Why not do it in style? <laughs> <laughs> uh, we've also got um, some cool mugs that have come in. Uh, heat changing ones, actually. Ooh, damn. So we've got this sick Jurassic Park one. Just nice, um, simple design there. But when you put coffee or whatever in it, it goes like that. It goes Hot bright liquid. yellow. So is that supposed to be like a like a ripped poster sort of design? Is that what the white bits are? Or yeah, it warm is. Warm it up with your hands. <sighs> where am I? Where is it? I don't know. The whole thing. The whole thing. Um, <laughs> Give me. So that. it's got. They are real. <laughs> we'll come back to it. We'll come back. <laughs> it's got. They are real on the reverse of the mug, Wait. and that also goes bright yellow once you've got hot liquid in there. Well, Jess Maybe is working you have to on that. Up the inside. <laughs> I can run to the kitchen. <laughs> Sprint. <laughs> I'm turning the mic off. No, I mean, I, we want to hear you. We want to hear the whole. <laughs> we want to hear the whole way. I, am I? Okay, I'm going. <laughs> All right. Just like we'll keep, see you in a bit. See ya. Just keep talking. <laughs> We've also <laughs> got uh, Harry Don't Potter house water. mugs as well. Now they all look like this. She she I'm on the melted. live and I'm walking yeah, in here. Running yes. away. She should have. <laughs> but it's fine. It's fine. It's fine. We can see on the box here. So once you add hot liquid, it does um, show the house color. So in this case, we've chosen Hufflepuff. So running. But we do have all Ooh, the other houses as That's well. You never know. Which is really cool. So you can have a fancy, fancy suit robe. Cup, and then it goes into the house. But it's also got the house um, on the reverse side as well, which is pretty cool. Yay! Heat changing mugs. Uh, we also have boppets. These are very noisy. So we have Grogu. Oh. <laughs> Boppet to start. Bop it. Pull it. Twist it. <laughs> <laughs> it's kind of unnerving with the baby sounds, but it's fine mm. if you're into Grogu yeah. and Mando. Yeah, I'm spilling it. Um, we also have... <laughs> she went out of range and she's come back in. I can hear her. She's got, she must have got something in the cup. She's worried about spilling it. <laughs> we also have uh, Darth Vader Boppet. Um, he is the voice of Emperor Palpatine. Ew, this so month? this is Darth Vader Question. as he's being controlled yeah. by Palpatine, which is pretty cool. <laughs> To start. Hi, Annie. Hi. Yeah. <laughs> Barbie. Mm. Yeah. Mm. I'm tired. Oh my god. You let me do that. It's a very oh, ominous yeah. it, I have Everything to say. Hurts. But if you're into Ow. that, stop it, Palpatine, bop please. Bop it to stop. Oh, I'm here we go. <laughs> yeah. There we go. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> yes. I awesome. survived Jurassic Park. I survived that run. <laughs> I knew sure I was going to make a cup of tea there. I was telling the viewers that they could hear me. Like, oh, should I make a cup of tea whilst I'm here? Well, <laughs> the thing is, they have a limited range. So we heard the panting and the running. <laughs> and, and then silence. And then 
more panting and running backwards. Like I get here you're worried about spilling hot hot water on yourself. <laughs> <laughs> I was like, ah, ah, ah. No. Worth it though, because look how cool the mug is. I want to oh, oh, be very careful with it. I don't know without looking. Yay. It wow. looks very good. I want to drink cool. it, but it's hot. Drink yeah. the hot water. No, don't, don't, don't burn your mouth. That'll ruin your whole no, weekend. No. No. Mm. All right, what else hot you got? Water. All right, we also have from from Meg. Pokemon. Meg, yeah, Gotta Pokemon. catch them all. Pokemons. We've got Eevee and we've got Pikachu as well. Pikapi. You, you can assemble them and they're interesting mm, shapes. Lego. This is an Actually, interesting Actually, no, shape. they're not Lego. Yeah. Mega. Mega. Yeah. But, uh, what a little I fun, ages seven and up, good time, good time. Oh damn. Mm. Pokemon. I'm old enough. <laughs> <laughs> Yay. Uh, we also have... Uh, Mirrorverse. Uh, yeah, Mirrorverse. Okay, so that's from uh, the Mirrorverse game. Basically, it's just tanked up Disney characters so they can like, oh, save the Mirrorverse. Uh, so we've mm. got Baymax. Ooh. Oh yeah. Baymax looking pretty cool, Baymax tank. We've got Anger. And he's melee, which is very appropriate. We also have uh, Captain Hook. I think that design is very, very cool. Mm. Like a warrior pirate. Melee kind of Captain thing, Hook. Which is pretty cool. And we also have Maleficent as well. And she's kind of in between, Mama. you know, sorceress and dragon form, which I think is a really, really sick design. Mummy? Sorry. <laughs> Mommy? Sorry. <laughs> Mommy? Sorry. I don't Mommy. understand all these memes. <laughs> the memes are taking over. <laughs> we also have a whole bunch of action figures here. So we've got a collab of Power Rangers and Street Fighter. Cool. Oh. Cool. Oh. This is pretty cool. So we've got Morphed Cami Stinging Crane Ranger, which Ooh. is quite a That's mouthful. A yeah. Wow. Yeah. All you need to know is that this is Cami. 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 Yeah, yeah, yeah. Comes with a um, range of accessories yeah. and stuff as well, as you can see yeah. on the back, Ooh. which is pretty cool. Pretty neat crossover. We also have morphed uh, Ryu. Mm -hmm. Ryu? Yep. Yes, thank you. Ryu, Ryu. <laughs> um, morphed Ryu Crimson Hawk Ranger. Another mouthful. These are all going to be quite a mouthful. Crimson Hawk, that's a yeah. badass name. Yeah, yeah. Damn. it's pretty neat. He comes with a range of accessories as well. Pop that one in the bank, Blake. <laughs> Crimson Hawk. Next up, we've got <laughs> Morphed Ken Soaring Falcon Ranger. That yes. sounds very mystical. And of course, we've got some cool accessories on the back there, some really cool effects and everything. And last up, Chun Li. <laughs> um, so Morph Chun Li, Blazing Phoenix Ranger, Ooh. which is pretty cool. I do dig blazing that it like the Bob Marley skateboards. <laughs> maybe a different kind of blazing. Mm. Damn. Maybe. Happy Friday, folks. <laughs> <laughs> we got some uh, Transformers from Hasbro as well, part of their Studio Series. I don't know a whole lot about these, but look, Transformers! Buzz, Yay. buzz, bumblebee, bumblebee, buzz. Well, that's pretty cool. <laughs> Damn. <laughs> of course, being Transformers, they can transform into a little vehicle. What is that? I don't know. It's a little vehicle. It's a little vehicle. We also have uh, Barricade. That's quite a name. Jeez. Buzz Buzz. <laughs> buzz Buzz. And he transforms into this. This These vehicle. These are weird cars. Yeah. But, oh, Here are my right, cars. They're all right. We also have... <laughs> Red Cog from Transformers Legacy. Again, know nothing name. about this. <laughs> but look at all the accessories you can get and look what it transforms into. That's that's yeah, a that's yeah, a mean that, looking That's pretty sick. That's a mean looking vehicle. It's got a feral cannon on it. It's mm. a mean automobile. Ooh. And we also have Ironhide. A baby. Yeah, a tiny Ironhide. I'm just And he transforms into a little van. Aww. A little van. That's nice. <laughs> Yay! <laughs> Vroom, vroom, Ironhide. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Vroom, vroom. <laughs> All right, next up God we bless. have lots lots of um, statues and stuff to get through. Welcome back um, to Jess's um, statue let's... review. <laughs> what about Dobby? What do you think of Dobby, Jess? We got a little... Dobby is a free elf. <laughs> you <a> freak. <laughs> Aww. Look at this little freak. Aww. Is he surfing? 
Cowabunga. He's just standing there. <laughs> no, no, Maybe no. he's serving. Turn yeah, that's his oh, he's, like, he's fully like, mm. Yes. Mm. He's pride. serving. <laughs> I mean, why not? He's, he's encased in glitter. It makes sense, and right? And he's dead. Oh, Ripped off. Spoilers. Spoilers. <laughs> <laughs> From Factory Entertainment, we've got this little replica of a Star Trek phaser, which I know nothing about. But it is pretty cool. You go zap. Zap. <laughs> 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 zap and um, So I don't think this is life size. Again, know nothing about surely Star Trek, but it's not. a well, surely not. But it's a cute little piece that you can kind of add in any way you want. You want some Star Trek in your office? There you go. It's going to fit in your office. Is this the gun part? Like, I think what? so. How do you hold that? Well, that that'd be the handle. Do you know what it looks like? You know the handle, that kind of like handle? It looks like, you know those old like fumigating things yeah. that they oh. pump and the gas would come out the end in like Warner Bros movies? Yes. That's what it looks like. I feel icky. There you go. <laughs> what do you have to like manually Star pump Trek. it up like a super soaker yeah. and shoot the laser oh, out? Yeah. It looks like a super yeah. soaker. All right, ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> Uh, if you're down bad for skinny white boys, I introduce you Victor from Corpse Bride and the Mrs. Pick him up. <laughs> no, Pick oh, him he's up. so tiny. Yeah, well, I don't want to reach. <laughs> so this is from the film The Corpse Bride, one of the best Tim Burton movies in my opinion. So we have Absolutely Victor great. and Emily sitting here on a nice chair, and we also have Scraps. I think this is from the moment actually when Emily gifts Victor Scraps' his bones and he comes back. I love that part. Oh, it's so gorgeous. Nice. I'm telling you, these legs are like twigs. Is His like legs are like cigarettes. <laughs> Is it about necrophilia? No, it's about... Is he dead? No, he's alive. He was but like... she's dead. Yes, yeah, she's the corpse bride. The, t- the titular... Yes, she is. <laughs> the titular corpse Get away bride. from her. <laughs> right, next. <laughs> also, <laughs> from, also from SD Toys, we have this really cool movie. How cool is this? We're going to need a bigger bow. <laughs> That was a mess. <laughs> <laughs> this, this is so, so cool. Look like the bubbles down here and the wow coming up and the, I reckon and the that's butt. Awesome. And the butt. That's important. But Damn. Yeah. And we've even got, you know, like a watery ripples. effect up here. Yeah, ripples. Ugh, imagine Swim looking lines. dancing in that. <laughs> Smash. <Yeah. laughs> this is very cool. And it's got the, obviously the Jaws logo at the bottom too, which is a really nice touch. Pretty sick. Yeah. Very, very cool. Now we've Spooky. got heaps and heaps of Iron Studio <sighs> statues to many. talk about. So many. So, you know what? Let's just start down here at the front with Captain America. Um, so this is based on the Battle of New York scene in the oh, Infinity Saga up. when the yeah. Avengers actually Spinning around, let's have a look at America's ass. True. <laughs> yeah. He looks like he got mad wedgie. It's, uh, yeah. it's pretty tight though. He's just yeah. trying to not chafe. <laughs> Now, this is pretty cool, though. This is part of a set to recreate the Battle of New York when um, the Avengers actually, like, properly assemble for the first time. You know, that scene where they're kind and of... It's it's just, yes, it's circling them. <laughs> and it's so epic. So we've got Thor as well. Ooh. Um, he looks very cool. He does have a wire um, cape, so you can... Let me come in and bellow. Hey, please. It's bellowing. You can get a nice billow going there. But I'm just loving like the detail in his armor and everything too, particularly How's the arms. Asgard's ass. Asgard. Nah. <laughs> <laughs> very, very but cool. It's all right. It's all right. Yeah. <laughs> Seven <And> out of ten. <laughs> it's and like John Travolta. That's <laughs> <laughs> mm. anyway, like young, young Travolta. Yeah. <laughs> also from that scene, we have Iron Man, Iron Man zooming up from the ground, which is pretty cool. Now uh, we didn't have. Um, batteries for this of course but I believe it does light up mm. at the base can we, we look at uh, the yeah. um, <laughs> the derriere and please there's, there's his butt yeah. mechanical butt mm. Mm, mech ass. Yeah, we do, have, we do have to show off all the butts because people are trying mm. to work out which superhero has got the best butt alright mm. mm. All right. damn ass alright who else we got we got turtle turtle turt, turt. spin him around which one's this which Donatello? It's a blue. Blue is Leo. Oh my god, true. Oh my god, look at his feet. 
<laughs> what are these two fellas? They're very anyway, cool though. This is a really awesome figure. Uh, really, I love the diorama on this piece. I just love all the goopy ooze mm. coming out the say, bottom. That's so vibrant. And he's in such a cool pose with his little swords and the bellowing of the back of his, uh, what's it called? His like mask. Yep. And then this is the back. Uh, turtle ass, anyone? It's like, it's like a sumo suit. Yeah, she has a better one than most of the others. Damn. Good on you. Damn. He's been doing the squats. Oh, mm. God, he's wibbling. Uh, but, yeah, no really cool piece, really dynamic piece, lots of texture, lots of things like that. But, yeah, really, really cool. And we've got another turtle as well. Oh, which one's the purple one, Luke? Donatello. That's right. done. I have never seen a thing of... Dinner. My bad. No, oh God, that's heavy. Now, <laughs> there are loose pieces on top, just okay. so you're aware. We've got oh. some ninja stars up there. He's got... Ooh, look at them. Yeah. Just chilling. Oh, yeah, they're loosey goosey. Just go ahead and assume yeah. his ass is on par with Leo's. Mm. Um, and we've got Tozies. And, yeah, more kind of matching the same as the other piece of all this cool piping and, like, the little details of the breaking, like, the breakage of the piping. It's actually quite... Like it has little remnants of green as if that's what the ooze once was, which is really cool. Ass. Nice. Yeah. And of course, nice. these are part of a set as well. We're just yeah. waiting on the other two to come in. These are but, really cool. Yeah, yeah fully yeah, assembled. Yeah, it's a yeah. really amazing Scary. diorama set you can put together, which is super awesome. Uh, from Space Jam... Arguably yeah. not the best, special, uh, best space jam. Um, we have LeBron James. LeBron James. <laughs> but this is pretty cool. This is based on the uh, signage, I guess you'd call it, that comes up during the movie on the court. And it's all like translucent stuff like that. So if you hit that with some LEDs, that's yeah. going to look really, that's, really good. It's giving like kind of 80s, new wavy kind of like aesthetic in a way with all the neons and stuff. It's really cool, just really cool. Brown James. Yeah, it's very cool. And, like, I'm loving how the Space Jam, uh, like, uniform or Toon Squad uniform, sorry, is just very bright. Mm. I love how it matches on, on the side as well. Like, you know, mm. it's, like, all on this side. And then the little hole where they'll come out and be like, that's all, folks. It's kind of, it's a cool matching set. Like, even that. I really like that detail. Yeah, very, very cool. And I believe we've had Bugs Bunny come through mm. um, from this particular line that Iron Shears has done as well. A great collectible of cool. a terrible yeah. movie. <laughs> Excellent. Yeah. Hi. Mm, uh, where else should we go? Should we go to Superman? Yes, Superman. Look at Superman, Superman. again from Iron Studios. I'm not going to pick this one up because it is quite heavy. Look at that but cape. Look at that cape. It's ben, lovely. Can you grab the other side and show you how billowing this can be? What's his yeah, wingspan? Yeah. This is massive. Damn. Damn. Yeah, yeah, this is quite big. This is almost uh, the same wingspan mm. as Captain America over God. here. It's but yeah, a massive. really cool piece. And I just love the stance, the powerful pose that he's holding and how vibrant the suit is in those gorgeous primary colours. Mm. Um, Very classic suit. Yeah, man. beautiful sculpt on the face um, with that one little, one little piece of hair that always falls down. Smash. Um, <laughs> but And a really cool diorama piece as well, which I, with all the, is that... What is that? It is the Fortress of Solitude. Thank I want to eat them. <laughs> but it really, really like cool. Fat. I see. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> I want them. I want them. I'm going to buy them. Uh, um, <laughs> can I get an um? um, um, um. <laughs> can I get a munch? But yeah, no, really yeah. cool piece if you love Superman. It's a very, very sick uh, piece. Next up, Yankee, do you want to talk about Captain America? America. Captain Falcon? America. It's Captain well, he America. was Captain Falcon. Now he's capping me. I have a now he's Avengers. So this <laughs> this piece is sick. Like the way they've it done is this is insane. Cool. So the wing actually slots into Ooh, this um, cool. watery base and is absolutely insane. I was really worried that it was gonna just like fall down mm. as I was carrying it in this room, but it is like really sturdy. And it's so, so dynamic, like even the curvature of the wings as he's um, just like gliding along <clears> the water. <throat> it just um, really yeah. makes up an incredible scene. Even though it's literally just him and a little bit of water, it just kind of brings everything to mind. I find it so interesting as well when we do, like when we put the statues together, we see how everything just connects and builds amongst itself. Mm. Like, as you said, like the way he's just kind of, what it looks like free falling, like how would that stay put in a statue but the sculpt of it not only for the you know the details and the costume stuff but the sculpt for it to support itself and actually be put together is really amazing a lot of engineering yeah a lot, yeah them. exactly especially really. that deku one from first four that was out of control yeah no insane but no that's a really cool uh captain america it is very very cool and we've got his um shield on the back here too just oh. bear with me while i 
carefully maneuver it out so you guys can have a look. Wow. There we go. So that um, is a separate piece as well, and that attaches cool. into the wings. And it's just it's such an amazing piece. So that is from um, the Falcon and the Winter Shoulder. Uh, shoulder. Oh, the Winter <laughs> Shoulder. The Winter Shoulder <laughs> TV <laughs> series. Yay. <laughs> but it's a very, very cool piece. Uh, mm-hmm. Next up, we have uh, Lady Deathstrike um, from X-Men, Marvel Ooh. Comics. Um, so this is really cool. Girl. This is a really <laughs> dynamic looking base. We've even Mommy? got like Sorry. broken bottles. <laughs> Mommy? Sorry. So we've got some broken bottles on the bottom here. Oh, no. Just really cool. She been hitting the sauce. There. And we've got like broken bits of wood or um, poking out as well. And of course, Lady Deathstrike just looking Deathstrike-ish. What's I, the deal I with her think... digits? They're long. <laughs> I don't. I really don't know much about Lady Deathstrike, but this is a yeah, really some... sick piece. Like even her armor on the back and everything. There's so much mm. detail, and it's just a really, really cool piece. Like look at this. One would imagine she's really good at a back rub. Mm. More back Ooh. scratch. Mm. Nice. Ooh. Spine tingling back scratch. Smash. 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 <laughs> Smash. Smash. And also, can I have a back scratch? Kind of vibe. <laughs> <laughs> we also have Saruman. Saruman from Lord of the Rings. Uh, this is a really cool piece. Let me just. Oh, so you have to see depth. this entire base. Like this is very very cool. Look how spiky. Look how spiky. Mm. Yeah. That's this, so cool. This is insane. Saruma. Saruma. <laughs> He's even got his staff here. Um, and like check out the detail on his sleeves and everything too. Mm. And along his cloak and everything. Just like no interest, uh, interest has been spent <laughs> in this piece. Like it is really cool. Like right down to his gorgeous flowing white locks. Everything's flowing. Back there. There's a lot of movement in that. Absolutely. Spot. It's really cool. Like he's really. standing on top of his tower and the wind's billowing through all his bits. <laughs> Not I'm bits. sure they are. <laughs> all his bits. Yep. Um, yep. You will taste on. man flesh. <laughs> <laughs> Moving on. If you play your cards right, you know what I'm saying. <laughs> <laughs> we I also have right. the iconic scene from Mandalorian where Luke Skywalker returns and takes Grogu to be trained. Um, this is a uh, part of a, a two-piece set, I believe. You can display it on its own. Um, I think the other piece might be R2-D2, if I remember correctly. But look, it's, it's so lovely. I was very excited for this scene. And you can see little Grogu's face. Little shiny, Bumpy. cute little eyes looking adorable, as he always does. But yeah, if you want to getting... encapsulate that scene, this is a really good Has he got his little piece. scrody little head hairs? <laughs> no, he doesn't. Oh. Unfortunately. He shaved. <laughs> Thank God. <laughs> <laughs> We've also got Jackie. Look at that hair. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's wild, hair. right? It's a really, really cool sculpt. There's a lot, a lot of detail there. Oh, is that knife hand, Chucky? Yeah, yeah, yeah. It is. Yes. Very, very cool. Um, so, yeah, really cool child's play piece. Um, obviously, he's on, like, some kind of conveyor belt. I don't know if that's in the toy store, in the factory. It's got to be, right? Yeah. That's really cool. Yeah, yeah it's neato. You don't see a lot of, like, knife hand kind of chucky stuff. So this is really, really sick. And obviously, it's a cute little piece that you can just put anywhere you like. That's the really cool thing about Iron Studios. They do really amazing work at an affordable price. And, you know, you can collect a lot of them as well because they're... Don't take up a lot of room on your shelf. Exactly. Yep. Which is really cool. Uh, we also have Batgirl. Batgirl no, being amazing. No, 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 Batgirl. Um, she's got her gun up here. I'm not sure if that's a grapple gun oh, or whatever. I want a grapple gun so bad. <laughs> <laughs> uh, we've got a little batty here, which um, actually oh. is magnetized. Batty or batty? Batty. 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 <laughs> Uh, but this is a really, really cool piece. There's so much detail in her costume and in the cape mm. and everything too, which is really, really cool. I'm quite mm. a fan of this piece. It's a really cool pose and everything too. It's getting on her face a bit. Getting on wow. her face. <laughs> wow. Daddy. Oh, too close. Oh, that's a sultry look. Mm. Yeah. It's that's awesome. Piece. Grapple gun yeah. looks sick. Yeah, it is a really, really cool piece. Uh, next up, we've got Peacemaker. 
if you can see him. <laughs> <laughs> but this is a really cool piece. So this is from um, the reboot of Suicide Squad. So we've got just kind of a, a muddy terrain going here. We've got some foliage. A you say? succulent. <laughs> a succulent. Mm. <laughs> uh, this is really cool. Um, the way they've brought um, the details of the pants to life. Mm. Like really cool textures there. And what's really cool about this piece too is that it does come with an interchangeable arm. So you can have him just like both kind of arms out like this and just like walking through or you can display him with his gun as well which of course we've chosen to do that and it also comes with an extra piece if you are putting on just the stride arm I'm going to call it the striding arm um, you can display his gun just sheathed um, mm. on his hip which I think is a really cool touch yeah sounds like no matter me. which option you choose the guns are out am I right mm, yeah absolutely <laughs> Um, we also have um, a couple of deluxe pieces here. So we'll start with Nathan Drake from the new Uncharted movie. Um, so, of course, Tom Holland being the reference there. And it's looking very Tom Hollandy, looking very nice, looking very good. Um, so this is a really cool dynamic piece. Um, it got the mouth right. Mm. Oh, absolutely. Um, so the difference between um, the regular version and the deluxe version is that the deluxe version, this one, has a lot more has a detail. <laughs> good, good. So it just has more in the base, like more like a, I think it's meant to be maybe a shipwreck. I'm not too sure. I haven't you seen You can the guarantee movie. it was once stood on by now it's fallen down. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Everything collapses in that game. Gosh. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But it is very, very cool. So if you want a lot of, like, um, dynamicness in your display, definitely go for the deluxe. Otherwise, uh, the standard version just has more of a flat base. But this is, like, really, really cool. Mm. Looking very Tom Hollandy. Flip. Tom Flip. Hollandy. And we've got another Flip. deluxe piece here, <laughs> which I'm sure him. Jess is excited to talk about. So this is an awesome deluxe piece that showcases Professor Snape in his potions classroom looking all menace menacing and just kind of wondering what antics Harry Potter, Harry Potter could be getting up to. Potter. Potter. Um, and just, I really love the colors and stuff in the kind of like glassware and things like that, um, in the potions room. Like, is there a polyjuice potion? What kind of, what things we got there? What kind of ingredients? I love seeing that. We can see a little mortar of pestle as well next to the cauldron. Everything's nicely labeled. He's a very organized man, I imagine. And his little book, book of potions, book of drinks, he's got his wand out and he just looks absolutely amazing. Snape is the so best character attitude. from Harry Potter. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So, so Stan cool. Snape, Stan Snape. He was just misunderstood. He I like was the old love. caretaker guy. Oh, <laughs> what was his, Filch, Professor yeah. Filch? Yeah. <laughs> All right, last up we have to show you today is this cute little um, Barney Gumble piece. So this is part of a collection um, of the Flintstones, of course, and his Barney's golfing. With his primitive little golf stick. Golf stick. Yeah, but never do. Definitely looks very, very clubbish, which is appropriate for that time. But yeah, this is pretty cool. The whole set looks really, really awesome as well. Like the um, cartoon series is just like brought to life. It is really, really cool. But yeah, Barney Gumble. And that's all we've got to show you guys today, which means it's prize time. Prize time. It's prize it's time. Prize time. Prize time. Shall we spin for a boomy first? The boom. Is it a boom, boom time? Yeah, you're right. The stick. boom time. Yes. Is it a boom time? You ready? Boom. We're going. Oh, damn. Look at that thing go. Yeah. Boomy, boomy, boomy. Boomy is for Amanda Fuller. Congratulations, Woo! you I have won a boomy here. If you want to send boomy. us your name, email address, personal address, and everything that you would need to send a parcel, send that through to us, and we'll send that through to you. Oh my God. What's next? <laughs> God damn. Jeez. What's next? Next up is the Garfield backpack. Garfield, Garfield backpack. backpack. I really need to get a drum roll on this thing. Damn. 
<laughs> Who's gonna win? Who's gonna win? It is Catherine Banks. Congratulations, Catherine. You have won the Garfield bag. If you want to send us your name, personal information, email address, everything that you would need to send out a parcel, we'll send that one out to you. You have won. Remember, guys, you can't win double. Uh, what are the extra prizes that we're gonna give away? Oh, there's extra prizes. Well, are That's we gonna do extra exciting. prizes? Let's do All it. All right, so one of them is. Cocaine bear. Yeah. Of course, with, with all the cocaine. Uh, who's going to get a little taste? Look at all that powder. <laughs> <laughs> Just one point. <laughs> <laughs> Congratulations, Sky. Taylor, you have one cocaine bear. You want to send us at your... God, I'm trying so hard to do this. Name, email address, <laughs> and personal information. We'll get that one sent out to you. Congratulations, Sky. Yeah, nose beers. Oh, God. <laughs> Happy Friday. <laughs> and we got more prizes to oh give away. We go, we're giving away Julie Spiderman. Spiderman! Yeah. Yeah. Flippy, flippy. Yeah. Melissa Frey, congratulations, you have won Julie Spiderman. If you want to send us your name, personal information, email address, you know the gist by now, ladies and gentlemen. Is there anything else? We have one more prize to give away. Oh, what are we giving away? We are giving away the three litre Morris oh. soda. As well, so that glug, is a glug glug glug. Happy Friday, <laughs> Lord Pat Lamb. All right, who's gonna win? Congratulations to Brad Harris. Woo! Drink you, up, drink yeah, up, glug drink glug. Hope you thirsty. Send us your <laughs> name, personal information, email address, and we'll get that bad boy sent out to you. Guys, that's been another week in review. Thank you so much for watching. We hope you have had a good time. Don't forget to say in the chat, R.I.P. Andy. Uh, <laughs> my name's Jess. This is Bianca. We have Blake behind the camera, of course, Luke over on the deck. We hope that you have a really good weekend, and we'll catch you in next week's episode. Yeah, yeah, yeah. See you later. Bye.